last time we went to a giant plant which was posing as a planet. Uh, we met a plant there with a top hat and a shotgun. Um, and uh, he wanted to join us because he loves murder. And um, when we were about to get off of the planet, we got attacked by a mammal. Um, because there's a race war going on between the plants and the mammals. So, uh, we escaped, and we went to, a, um, an asteroid, and as we were on the asteroid, uh, we saw a star get consumed by a living black hole, and we almost died as well, and all of our characters are pretty shaken up about that. And, uh, that's where we left things off last time, so... Uh, I guess we'll pick up right from everyone's trauma. Ew. So, they are um, still flying away from the ship. Um, Cybrix is taking um, like sporadic paranoid glances backwards to make sure that um, the Swartz child is not following them, even though no one knows what they really look like, so... He's got no idea if it's following them or not, but he's telling himself that it's not. Uh, what what are the others doing? That was... That was awful. Oh, uh, yeah. Scary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd, I'd say it's all those things. Okay. All right. Um, wasn't wasn't we gonna play some cards or something? Do do you have cards? Wait, you're a stick. Where did you have card? I'm losing my mind. There's a set over on your on your driver area thingy. Who put those there? I I swear I don't remember. Oh shit! Are these Gambleopolis playing cards? Oh. 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 Ah. Uh, that's um. Yeah. Let's just, let's just put those in the glove compartment and not mention that I have those. Were they stolen? Why do you well, have them? Considering I don't remember taking them. Uh. Yeah. Probably. Wow. So where were we off to again? Ah, uh, Sarah appears. You were going to show us where some weapons were? Yeah, yeah, that's that, that's right. You were going to show us where we could get some new weapons and stuff so we could take on the, the pirates or something right uh well <laughs> roll for intelligence oh boy Yo. oh okay <laughs> as Platt tried to dig through his memories or, or the the other guy's memories uh, uh so someone's memories um he was able to remember another memory with the pirates. As he was sitting in a room, or, well, again, the, the person who appears to be him in these memories was sitting in a room looking at a monitor screen. It showed an image of the planet known as Earth 2. Yeah, yes, there, there, there is an Earth 1 and an Earth 2, which Platt does remember. Um, and even in this memory, he appears to be asking another pirate, why is it called Earth 2? And uh, the reason, at least, that he was told was that on Earth 1, um, it got overpopulated. So mm -hmm. they sent a whole bunch of other people over to a very similar planet, uh, which they named Earth 2. And apparently there was, there, there was a lot of problems with that, because... There wasn't just humans living on that planet. Um, but things are apparently cool now. So, 
Um, and apparently that planet has the most amount of weapons um, out of any planet in the solar system, mainly due to uh, what was called the Global United Militia, um, which resides on Earth 2. Well, that sucks. We have to go to Earth 2. Earth 2? Where is that? I hate Earth 2. Man, you can't... They're, they, they are the worst at Earth 2. I tried to sell... And he brings up his box of junk. I tried to oh. sell this at Earth 2. I where really is, did. Where, where exactly is Earth 2? It's it's over that way, and he's just he's just kind of like pointing towards the right. Like it, we we gotta we gotta make a U turn and go all this way but, just so we can go there and ask people, hey, you want to buy this? And they'll say, no, I don't got the money right now. And then someone just steals something out of my box. Like I but guess if well, we go, if hey, we make a U turn, they wouldn't steal so much if your ship had nastier looking weapons. Which we'll be able to get at Earth two. Yeah, I, I guess. But how are we gonna do that? I mean, I mean, if we turn around, won't we go back towards the the black hole, living nah, hole thing? No, nah, no, nah, we're, we're we're good, right? Right, Sarah. Sarah. Sarah, please answer. <laughs> she she just vanishes. Well, it's if we fine. Can't... If we can't turn directly around, because then we'll get consumed by the void, could we not make a long turn instead of a direct U-turn, you know? Yeah, okay, yeah, 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 we'll, we'll give that a shot. But we can, right. we can either buy weapons, or we could even just take them. Oh, that's much, a funny idea, I think. How, 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 um, how, how much money do you guys have on you? Wait, you're a thousand. You're a plant. Do you, do, do you got, do you guys care? Do you have an economy on that planet? Yes. It consists of murder. Oh. Oh, boy. Wait, so, like, 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 what's, what's the exchange rate on murder? There is no exchange rate. You guys like? Oh, uh, I'm you guys joking like, with you. We don't have an economy. It's oh, okay, okay, um, yeah. Uh, so, sorry, you're just you. You sound like really serious. So I'm, I'm just I'm not. You know, technically it's based off murder, but that's only because it's just uh, it's just uh, animals and plants eating each other. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I got it. Um, yeah, well, uh, we'll, we'll do the long turn in, uh, you said you had 5,000. <clears> that means we only got, like, 7,000 credits. <sighs> Fuck. Well, who's that uh, giving it to you? Okay. <laughs> All right, listen. Well, we'll see how much their weapons are worth, but judging from how everyone on that planet seems to be a cheapskate uh it's probably gonna be uh, way more expensive and then uh i guess we'll hopefully have to figure out how i stole these cards and use that to steal a gun or something that's the spirit yeah though i have a funny feeling based off the fact that you don't remember it and that you were in a casino or a planet-sized casino you were probably drunk yeah probably I I I got really <clears throat> depressed when I lost everything. Uh so yeah, that that's probably what happens. Oh. Did you steal them from the dealer? You know I I don't know, but if I did, we've probably got a third group trying to kill us now, so I'd rather not think about that. Maybe they'll try and kill each other in the process. Maybe would, we could trick them I mean, into doing so. That that would that would be nice. That would be preferable. 
it could, Sarah, it could be like a free for all. Sarah appears again. <laughs> wow, you're all just a bunch of assholes, aren't you? <laughs> you said it, sister. <laughs> I I don't believe I have one of those. <laughs> That's the only oh, thing. Oh, I come have. on. Come on, if, if the stick has one, you got one, too. That's the only thing that I have, Sarah. <laughs> so that would mean you are literally an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> Cypress <laughs> starts making the log turn around so they can start heading towards Earth, too. Um, do they want to try and do anything? Wow. Uh, all right, perception check. Him. Damn. Okay. As Wicker starts looking out, trying to see if he can find anything else interesting about, uh, well, he doesn't appear to see the Swartz child, so that's good. Um, and then. Of course, the existential dread sets in again once he looks and sees that the uh, asteroid is yeah n nowhere to be found. No, no piece of it left, just gone. Um, so uh, yeah, but he does not see any like nearby stars getting consumed. So hopefully that means the Swartz child is gone. Um, as for anything else. Mm, not nothing really of note. Uh, <clears throat> he does see like what appears to be just another star. It's it's kind of brighter than like the the other stars around them, but it's like nothing. Nothing seems to be too off about it, so it doesn't seem like anything too special. Interesting. Well, I think we're clear, you guys. There's are not under any kind of danger. <laughs> Cybrix has uh, two of his tentacles, like, shuffling the deck of cards. So, uh, you, you guys know how to play blackjack? Yeah, but I'm not betting money. I'll play well, for fun. All right. Uh, all right. Wait, is this enough for three people? And I don't then... know how to play anyways. Oh, yeah, that's true. Okay, uh, I, I guess it'll just be between me and Wicker. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Boom boom clip, do you, do you know how to play Blackjack? Boom, boom clip? He might have muted himself. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot they could do that. Yeah, yeah. Man, Boombox men are weird. Maybe, maybe even his batteries may have died. I mean, he doesn't seem to have a power. Cord, so, do, do they? They don't run on batteries, do they? No, they don't. Yeah, I, I didn't think so. Wait, they, how do they? Do do they have like? Do do they have organs? I don't think you want me to explain that. I mean, probably not, but, like... How, how does that... exist? Can we, can we play What's that? significantly more surprising to me is that you're questioning it to begin with. <laughs> Cybrix looks at himself. Yeah, yeah, I guess. I guess that's fair. <clears throat> All right, yeah, here... All right, here I'm. I'm passing out. He's he's passing out the cards. All right, <laughs> I guess I guess we'll let's roll to see uh, see who who wins. Who, who wins. Would that be a one d twenty? Uh, yeah, one d twenty. Oh. Um. Well, <laughs> <laughs> somehow without any arms, hands, anything like. That. God. <laughs> Wicker wins. He wins three <laughs> times in a row. Cybrix is utterly defeated. You have to be cheating. Like the, <laughs> you are you hiding a card somewhere? <laughs> you roll it up Where? in your ass. 
<laughs> Where am I going to hide a card? In your ass. I just said it. <laughs> well, my ass is how I talk. So if I if I have one in there, then I wouldn't. Damn it! You're right. Oh. I mean, I mean, I mean, you have a you have a look if you if you're kind of suspicious, but uh, no, no, I. <laughs> he seems very <laughs> conflicted about whether he should check or not. <laughs> you should roll, roll to see if he should. <laughs> you know what? Sure. Knowing, knowing his luck, this will be the first twenty. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I swear. Okay, no, it's a sixteen though. It's not. You've got two 16s in a row. <laughs> as he, as he, he like brings his his like robot hand close, a an attachment extends out from it, which is an even <laughs> smaller robot hand, and goes <laughs> inside of Wicker's asshole. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I think I got something. Okay. I knew you were cheating as he... Pulls it out. It's so, uh, it looks like some sort of a small crystal. Uh, that could be. That's his, that's how he. That's how he's able to talk. Oh, uh, do 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 you need this? Like I I didn't just pull out your heart, did I? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! I'm more. I'm already gonna go to jail for for stealing. I don't want to go to jail for murder now. Do you want to try to just like put it back in? I I, I guess I don't. Man, I don't even know how this works. It, it, there, I I think it's back. I, oh, That's, that that is that is my magic crystal. Though those can also be something them pirates are after. I I forgot to mention uh, they could either be uh, after they could be after. That or they could be after the. Wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. <clears throat> is, is that how you have psychic powers? I think so. I don't know, honestly. I just know uh, it really hurt when you pulled it out. Ah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have to wash this attachment later. <laughs> you have to dip it in oil. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna. Uh, uh, I'm gonna have to beat <laughs> past this whole arm. Can I ask you, why do you have a that knight's tentacle? I, I, would, I was born with it. What do you? I, I listen, man. I, I don't, I don't like to talk about my ninth tentacle. All right. <laughs> if that's what it really is. Yes, it it is a ninth tentacle. Okay, listen, I know it's shorter than the rest. <laughs> it's an I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, I have a I have a request very quickly. Can Platt like have a flower for a head, like yes. the, the top hat sits on? Okay. I thought the whole thing was a flower. I, uh, I in my <laughs> head it was just a like a a house plant, just leaves. Yeah, I just, I, I like, I, I, I prefer it having like a, a flower as like a head. To um, c can we have it to where the flower literally just grows in? Yes. <laughs> just like the, staring like out the, the window. Like the like the top hat starts like moving upwards as the flower is revealed. Wait, what's going on with? What's going on with Platt? He looks kind of. What's happening? Uh, do 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 we need to do we need to go? I don't I don't know how your race does things. Uh, have you never seen a plant before? I I mean I mean I've I've seen it, but like I, I man I just grabbed something out of someone's ass. I don't know <laughs> what that means. Well, that sounds like a you problem. Yes. Yes, it very much is. I'm slowly realizing what I just did. <laughs> and I'm regretting every second of it. But, um, well, that's good. 
But do you think you want? I'm doing what most plants do, and I'm flowering. Well, good. I'm I'm glad that's just a, a natural thing, and it doesn't mean something weird is going on. Look, man, I I I just need to be by myself for a minute. I'm wait wait I'm, wait, wait. I'm before spiraling. you go, Cybrix. Cybrix, before you go, do you want to play another game? <laughs> another game of blackjack. You know what? One more w- game, but this time we're playing poker. I will bring it back. Okay. And we are not doing strip poker. I mean, I have nothing neither to strip. Of you wear, neither of you wear clothes. I. Yeah, listen, listen, I listen. G- Gambleopolis messed me up. Okay, it, it it didn't it didn't matter if you had clothes or not. Is that what is that what happened to your ninth tentacle? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> no, wait, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Would you like to roll for poker? Yes. Man, what's with the sixteen? How? <laughs> How have we rolled four sixteens in a row? <laughs> What, what what do we do about no. this? <laughs> oh my god! Four sixteens in a row. It's not, even, it's not even like a poker game. It's just a Yu-Gi-Oh <laughs> battle now. <laughs> like it gets all serious. So wicker, I see that you have your three of clubs, but my my four of diamonds will be able to defeat you. Oh, you want to bet? <laughs> and Wicker puts down the Queen of Hearts. <laughs> I knew you were hiding that in your ass. <laughs> what, the, what the hell is wrong with you in my ass? <laughs> At least you already know what's in my ass. You done murder me. All right, fine. I didn't want to have to do this, but it's time I break out my secret weapon. All right. Cheater. Let's let's roll again. Okay. 18, damn. Oh. oh. <laughs> By the way, Gavin, we rolled four oh, wow. 16s in a row. <laughs> I saw <laughs> Cyber, Cyber, he, he unfolds his one arm and a card does come up out of the attachment wicker wicker's afraid this isn't any normal card this here is erasia the ultimate monster card i thought he was playing poker this is poker! As he places the card down, the creature emerges out of the card. The creature <laughs> emerges out. <laughs> Suddenly, all of the cards, all of the creatures on them emerge. Ooh. And Erasia fires a beam that destroys all of Wicker's heart monsters. And fires it a beam! It's Wicker. He is hit and thrown into the back of the ship. Wow. My man went from playing poker to playing Yu-Gi-Oh. Right. (laughs) Ah! You son of a bitch! (laughs) (laughs) I... I am... You won't get away from this. I am the king of battle monsters. Here, here. He wants to shoot Thorn Blaster at him, just like, you jerk. It was a one. <laughs> he wow, dude, a one. One, one splinter at him, and it it doesn't like it. It doesn't even fly out. It just <laughs> flops on the ground. And not only that, but after <laughs> after Wicker like gets himself out of the wall and lands on the floor, the splinter goes into him, which shouldn't hurt, but it does. Did someone, like, get this out of me? Who, who turned on the... 
Connor, did you do that? Yeah. Did can it you, feedback? Can, yeah. yeah. Okay. I was just asking something, but go ahead, continue. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> okay, I can continue. Um, Alrighty. Jacob. Can somebody, like, pull this splinter out of my ass? Or my, my foot? Or whatever this thing is? <laughs> you can't tell the difference between your ass and your foot? You know, that's a really oh, bad thing. Stick. Like, it's all the same. The oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> I just, I just see Platt's just like wide eyed, still can't even believe. Like, damn, he really did change that from poker to fucking Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> so, uh, cool game. Oh, yeah, thanks. Uh, yeah, it was, it was a little, little Gambleopolis, uh, trick there gets them every time you mean literally changing the game at the very last second yeah <laughs> isn't that cheating no no it's not it's not cheating if you know if, if you get blown up in the blast before you can say it's cheating i may or may not have been burnt by multiple erasias while I was there. So, so they even used the same card? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Like like everyone knows about this. Wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's yeah, it's, it's, it's bad. It is it's a bad place. I have a much better way of running a casino. <laughs> really? So do I. Yeah, I shoot fire whenever they foot. enter so the door, water. you shoot them. It's oh, a gamble uh, because they don't know if they're entering a real casino or if they're about if their foreheads are about to be obliterated by a twenty-two slug. Oh, you and I. We have so you mean extreme game. Russian roulette? Yeah, they have that there. Well, it's like Russian roulette, except you don't willingly spin the revolver. Yeah. Yeah, they have that there. Like I That's can, just have... murder, Cybrix. I, I I am I, describing murdering people. Yeah, yeah, I I know. I know that that they have that there though. It it's called extreme russian roulette. See, the only difference is there's a sign out front that specifically says what's going to happen. So, mm. they're leg they are legally allowed to do that. They make a sign Wow. Of what chumps? <laughs> <laughs> I just shoot fire at them. If I ran a casino, mm -hmm. I wouldn't care about the law. And if yeah. the law came after me, I would annihilate the casino with the law in it. <laughs> I, I, thought, I thought he was going to stop there. And instead of saying uh, annihilate the casino with the law in it, I thought he was going to say, I'd annihilate the casino with the law. <laughs> That sounds like something good one would say, honestly. No, but, uh, no, but do they even have law on your planet? Isn't your planet just a plant? I mean, no. No? Well, Wait, yeah, like, how, how does your planet work? Like, are there other... Chloroid? That's a, that's what you're called, right? Chloride. Are, are there other chloroid like you going around? Maybe not like me, but there are other chloroids. Oh. Wait, wait a minute. They, they weren't those like hand-looking trees, were they? Maybe some of them were. Oh. oh okay. It is entirely possible that if we would have stayed even five minutes longer, your ship would have been consumed into the ground. Oh. Okay, well, I feel less bad about chopping through some of them, then. I hate you. <laughs> Anyways. How old are you? <laughs> Oh, J Jacob, you are cutting out really bad, man. 
Hold on. There we go. I said, how old are you? I'm, uh... Who? I'm 799. I only got a year to live. <laughs> let's, let's not worry about it. Uh... Oh, look, there's Earth 2! <laughs> wow! It sucks. <laughs> As they look out, it looks they like see... my ass. It's just a hole. <laughs> <laughs> they see a glowing blue planet. And that looks like my ass. <laughs> Cybrex <laughs> turns <laughs> the light and the you're crystal. and you're complaining to me about focusing on your ass. <laughs> well, you're the one said I was cheating, having a card up in it. Yeah. Cause you did, you know what? No, never mind. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Earth two. Let's go. Um. Let's hopefully not land in the ocean. Oh, can I, I do precision check to see if we can find a place to land? Uh. Well, I, well considering that Cybrix is piloting, he'd have to do it. But if he fails, yes. Okay. Cause I was just, I like to look out the window. That's why I like doing precision. I like wicker to be. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> as they enter Earth 2's orbit, suddenly a purple lightning bolt strikes the ship. And this doesn't just do some minor damage or anything. No, it completely blows half of the ship off. I, I, I um, wow. What the hell was that? And more. Did it take Sarah? Sarah Sarah's still here. Oh man. Just barely That's though. Part of her's just on the other side of the ship. Cybrix quickly de detaches her from the ship. As uh, they are swiftly falling. And can I bring? Can I try to grab her with the tele? Well, I mean, you. She's fine. It's okay. it's just that now we're falling at an at an incredibly fast rate, which is not good because we just entered the atmosphere. Man, fun oh. fact about Earth Two: it has a very thick <laughs> atmosphere. We are probably going to burn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Think. Ooh. At least it's a quick burn. It's not like someone just setting you on fire multiple times. Oh yeah, that makes it much better. Well, it I actually mean, is you, much you better. You would know. You would know because plants are. How are you not on fire? <clears throat> what? How are you not burning? I'm just imagining a little like flame sparks up off uh, on one of his leaves, and he just like puts it in the soil. <laughs> yes, as they're falling faster. Okay, Jacob. So Wicker tries to extend his psychic pulse in order to catch the ship, but it was not strong enough. The ship is still falling at an incredibly fast rate, and oh wait, due that, to that. that roll that role what? was for me to look for a place to land. I think we're early. beyond landing at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So no. it, it didn't count for that. It counted for. Okay. Yeah. Hey, Cybrix, are we heading towards a body of water by any chance? Um, I don't know, but it probably, and that won't help us because by the time we hit down there, I'm pretty sure we're gonna be dead. All right. Dead. I forgot. What do we do? Oh no! Cybrix tries to connect his tentacles onto the side of the ship, and with two of them pointed down, he tries to fire out his laser beams to try and propel the ship back upwards. However, that is also not working, and he can feel his arms about to be ripped off. This was a very bad and stupid idea! Uh, it was your idea, bud. Thanks for reminding me. 
Uh oh. You want you want a pizza TV dinner? Wait. Flat wants to try and get on one of the coil guns. If, if Ooh, the, if okay. One still left. Yes, yes, there is one left. Okay. And he just wants to shoot it forward. Roll. I got the pepperoni and I'll like put on the pizza. Fuck. Damn. We're out of I thought you were gonna roll it. <laughs> we're gonna die. <laughs> no. Can can um oh, no. can Wicker try to grab again with Wait a minute. I just thought of something. What? Hunter, I'm I'm gonna roll for you, but I'll 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 illustrate okay. this first. Um, Platt <clears throat> goes on top of the coil gun and tries to fire it forward. Yes. However, due to the massive blast, it appears that the coil <laughs> gun's functions have been disabled. Wait, 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 wait. What if, uh, what if I try to do the um, thorn storm again? Hold up. I'm, I want to roll this for Hunter. I want to okay. see. Uh, the coil gun isn't working. Well, that's a problem. <laughs> Seven. Yeah, it's a seven. Man. <laughs> oh. Why, Dice Maiden, why'd you have to give us the, all of those 16s at the start? No. Yeah, these, all these rolls have been bad. <laughs> Not my next one. My next one's going to be good. Boom Clip finally wakes up and sees that they're all about to die. So what he tries to do is using yeah. his... Great elasticity. He stretches his legs all the way down to the ground and tries to stable himself to keep the ship lifted up. Um, but due to the velocity that they're flying, all this does is make him fly out of the ship. That's all you're getting. Down towards wherever they were going to land. <laughs> you know, fuck. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with all of you. I think if we stay on this ship, we're going to die. But we could yeah. not stay on the ship. I'm like, I, we're still falling at an increased rate. We're probably going to catch on fire if we continue falling. Well, anyway. Can I, can I try something? Can I, can I try to give us some boost with my thorn Yes, wire? do anything. <laughs> I have a really stupid idea. Well, I mean, we're, we're running out of options here. I have a really idea. It was a 10. Idea. I know it's a 10. So, Wicker tries to fire the splitter shot downwards, trying to help propel them up. It is slowing their descent very slightly, but not by much. Hey, Cybrix. Yeah. Do you, do you have any like uh, like I don't know, water or plant food or like uh, miracle grow or something? Uh, mir. Uh, I mean, here. I let me let me check. He he checks like in the back room and that and <clears throat> that like closet area where the engines are because. Um, you know. Half of that was blown away, but the other half is still there. He's searching. Uh, yeah, I I think I've got some some water with some I I don't know some sort of miracle grow or something. I don't know. It, it tastes good. Uh, That's disgusting. Can you pour it on me, please? Instead uh, of killing yourself with it. <laughs> I, I guess. Okay, Corey. Here <laughs> is my idea. Yeah. Can my leaves grow really big? I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> Can you roll? Oh, God. Yeah, okay. Ah. Uh, as he pours in the miracle grow, Platt looks deep inside himself and tries to have that miracle grow start going directly towards his leaves and as he does they start to grow at an incredibly accelerated weight or rate and soon enough they can feel the ship has stopped falling and it's because platt's two leaves are now gigantic <laughs> and are working as wings oh uh, wait 
Huh? Yay! We're alive! Ah! Oh. Boom clip! We're. Oh. <laughs> I, yeah, I he fell out earlier. Yeah, uh. You, you think he made it? Probably. <laughs> Boom clip! If you can hear me, are you okay? If you're not okay, say something. Yeah, he's okay. <laughs> wow, Cybrix. <laughs> what? <laughs> look, man. Look, man. We look, man. We we almost died. We only knew Boom Clip for like an hour. Just... Well, it's a better fate than being consumed by the void. Ah, uh, that that's true. Probably. You know what I just thought of, guys? Was that? Well, we are landing properly, correct? Uh, I have no idea. I, I wouldn't call this properly, but we'll, we'll probably land. Well, I just remember that if you if you uh, if you put mirror. Uh, Jacob, you, you cut out, Jacob. I was going to say uh, he oh, did I cut was... out. There you go. You're back. I said if you put miracle grow on me, I will. Go... <laughs> <laughs> I think Discord the miracle grow. I was gonna say I don't think the miracle grow is gonna work. You uh, you okay, you messed you up me? his you messed up his voice by taking that crystal out of his ass. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, I said, if you put miracle grow on. <laughs> every time, literally every time. You're every about time to say you talk about Miracle Grow, it just like <laughs> is it, okay, Discord's me, like no. Yeah, let Discord's me, like Jacob, shut up. That's a stupid idea. <laughs> let me dumb it down, okay? Yeah. Miracle Grow, me, two feet taller. Okay. I mean, yeah, yeah. Do, you, do, you, do you want Cybrix to, to do that? No, nah, I'm just saying that's a helpful thing. I don't know what I could be used for as right of right now, but... Oh, I, I, I just thought of what he could be used for. <laughs> okay, I'll roll for it then. Damn. Oh, you rolled a 12. I mean, so, so did... Yeah, and then here, let me check your stats. That would be... That would be strength. Yeah, oh yeah, your strength's ridiculous. So, <laughs> Wicker decides to just pour the rest of that water on him. Hey, what, did, did, I, I was drinking that. Well, <clears throat> do you want to survive this fall or what? We're, but we're 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 fine now. What do you uh? And as, as that's going on, Wicker is growing, and he he grew more than than two feet longer. Uh, yeah, he's about like six feet long right now. Uh. So wait, that's Cyber, what she do you said. actually do you just go to the gardening section at a? general store and drink all of the chemicals there or something i not not all the chemicals just just the just the water with the the plant stuff mixed in like the water with the chemicals in it yeah 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 i mean i mean it tastes good man I mean, well, what does that do for you cybrix <clears throat> it, it tastes good like i mean listen my home planet is literally just all seawater like, 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 just seawater, regular water. Like, it's it, it's all boring. It, it needs some some new flavor in there, and I don't know. I drink root beer, and I like the chemicals. All right, don't judge me. Toxic that is. Just shut up. Well, it's your funeral, probably yeah. literally here soon. Yeah, it will be. Thanks. Don't expect miracle grow. You will be buried in. 
<laughs> is that just gonna be Wicker's voice now because he's really tall? Yes. <laughs> okay, if you want to know the idea I had on why I said that would be a good idea, because I I was imagining, um, Platt could use him as a bow staff. Don't you mean Cybrix? No. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm working just, together. I'm, Don't drink. I'm beer, just imagining okay. someone's like having a conversation with Cybrix, like some really rich guy is talking to Cybrix. Beer, and Cybrix is all excited, oh, yeah. he's about to sell him something. And then like Cybrix messes up and the rich guy is about to like walk away and Platt just starts ruthlessly caving his skull in with Wicker. With wicker. Yes. <laughs> yeah. That's a, that's exact that's a You know, I was going to say Wicker's so voice could be so, a little something like this. Did I just get hit in the head with a stick from a plant? Wow, Cybrix, isn't that neat? When they're completely immobile and most likely dead, Is you can just take me? their money. <laughs> I mean, I mean, yeah, that. I mean, that doesn't. I, you know. Oh, yeah. don't tell me you're caring about him. No, it's just, I, you know, I, I wanted to actually sell something but i guess i'll just well now you can get the money without even having to get any yeah without having to give anything up that's I mean, not the point retard oh i'm <laughs> sorry i didn't mean to call you retard but oh, no. that's not the point he wants to get rid of his junk here i'll well, just i'll just put it on his corpse it's fine well no what you can do is you can use the junk to pretend <laughs> that you're selling stuff and then you can just fucking kill them Oh, yeah, perfect. I'm. Yeah, I'm. I'm not. I'm. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that. I mean. I mean. It's. It's. Look, well, man. It's not like you're selling anything, anyways. Look, 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 man. I. I. I know that that you love killing, and and I'm. I'm not judging you for that, but I'd rather not kill if I don't have to. God. Well, I don't know. You've already killed me once. I t I Are you bag, never you going to let that go? I would have died. In 30 minutes. Didn't put that back First of hand. all, you stopped yourself in midair with your psychic powers. Second, I did save you afterwards. <laughs> I like how we're just having a flash forward right now. Yes. I'm the... I'm... I'm imagining this conversation is going on. It's just instead of kill, like actually killing a guy and doing it, um, Platt just re now realized, like, wait, if you're trying to sell stuff, why don't you just kill them instead and take their money? And that's Isn't how that this how conversation happened. Isn't that how most people get happened. rich anyways? I, I mean, is that how Jeff Day got rich? I mean, yeah. Jeff... I like, mean, he didn't I don't, use a stick. I mean, look, man, Jeff. Jeff, Be he he runs Brock's on. They they sell everything. Like, <laughs> I don't think he he'd have to kill someone to get where he is now. He literally sells anything you need. Well, then, how or do things you don't get need. Cybrix, you haven't <laughs> even seen the start of it. Wait, uh, is is Wicker still big? Yeah. Okay. Okay. He can grow. He can grow even more if he has. More yes, stuff. if he get. Yes, if he gets more <laughs> plant food. I, I like the idea that we've been landed. <laughs> like we're just on the ground. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They they have landed. Oh, he's boom never clips. noticed. Boom clips there. By the way, he's he's fine. A bit waterlogged though. He's got a fish sticking out of uh, one of his speakers, but he's fine. Anyways, guys, we've Is been on the ground brother? for the past ten minutes. Oh. oh. Where are we? Yeah, wait. Is this a runaway? Can I do precision? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. If, if we're on a runway, I want to look and see if we can't find a plunge Please. Light. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> I'm a murderer, not a criminal. 
<laughs> yeah. As Waker is looking around, he sees, oh, yeah, there's a plane. Oh, huh. It, it's getting Wait, closer. It's coming right oh. at us. Oh, no. <laughs> that is exactly what's going on. There is a plane going right. Well, not a plane, actually. It appears to be a, um, a planetoid spacecraft. These are spacecrafts that are meant um, only for traversing the planets that they are on, not for um, just interstellar travel. <clears throat> Well, you know, it's not my fault that I am trying to abide by the local global tra or air traffic laws. Oh, we've broken that. We're right in the middle of a runway. Uh, I yeah, think we should be more concerned with land. the fact that we are about to get hit by a ship. Why Maybe are we talking? if that we pilot was inclined. <laughs> <Plat, laughs> I imagine, I imagine he ship. like... I imagine oh, like, like he just I, I imagine he just barely <laughs> misses just us. Flat, like tip top hat angrily storms off of the ship, starts walking up to the to the other ship. Like, now you I'm going to speak with your manager. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm Karen. Going to speak with your manager, and then you won't have a manager. Because I'll <laughs> no, kill his eyes. Okay, you Karen. I imagine that the guy, the guy, just like stops. Either he stops right at the edge of our ship before he uh, makes collab or collision, or he just manages to raise over our ship. Oh, uh, so he, so he does stop. He stops right before the engines can burn, uh, plat, and he comes out. It appears to be a human, uh, with some very unkempt brown hair. He appears to be wearing some uh, pilot's goggles on top of his head, not on his eyes. Uh, I don't think you're supposed to be there. <clears throat> well, I didn't have any actual propulsion systems on this craft to properly land, because some... We were struck by magic in orbit or something. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's... That's the Skull King? Yeah, um, we're, we're actually getting sent out now to try to deal with him. Um, so... The what? Yeah, uh... Did, are you are you guys new here? We just crashed in from orbit, so... Uh, yeah, yeah. Not yeah, technically, yeah. we've been here for around 20 yeah, minutes. Yeah, I mean, I mean I've, <laughs> I've been to the planet before, but I, I don't remember a, a Skull King... Oh, oh well, it, it's that guy over there, and he he points out over the um to, just like over towards the left a little bit. And as they look over across the ocean, oh yeah, th there is definitely a um being that looks like a skeleton, uh, wearing some bright red sunglasses, um, maniacally laughing, as purple lightning bolts are coming out of his hands. I'm gonna have a word with this man. No boy. Wait. Be careful. <laughs> Does he still have his big leaves? Is he gonna fly over there? <laughs> I'm gonna have a word with him. He starts flapping. <laughs> a flying plane. Do you, want, <laughs> do, do you want you want to do it? Sure. Okay. Roll. We're, gonna, we're gonna do it. All right, yes. Ow. <laughs> you know what? Can I use my inspiration? Well, okay, what, what is he actually trying to... Because if he's just trying to fly... I honestly don't have any idea. I think can, so. Because he can fly. Oh, um, okay. I'm, I'm fine with you flying with them. If you wanted to do something specific... No, just fly fucking over Okay. <laughs> Starts flapping his leaves. <laughs> it starts flying up. As he does, he he can hear the maniacal laughing getting louder as he gets closer. <laughs> Sound effect. <laughs> there, there's your sound effect. 
Wow. You, he sounds just as maniacal as he looks. <laughs> and he, he looks down with his flowing black robe and sees the plant approaching. So, one of the pot. You believe that you can defeat the Skull King? A lightning bolt strikes as he says that. Why are you even here? Why? Because I'm here to bend this city to its knee! I mean, someone just flew in, like, very leisurely onto, an, onto a runway. It really seems like it's business as norm, like usual here. Well, yeah, yes, that, that's because I, I need to summon my monster. Oh. Oh, what's the monster like? I I don't know yet. I, I'm trying to summon him right now. Oh. Well, that sucks. What, what, what do you... What the, that's just how we do things, man. I, I summon the monster, send it out to destroy the city, the GUM always kills it somehow, and then I go back to my base, I say, curse you, GUM, and go away, and then I come back the next day. That's Curse, you pay the platypus. for you? <laughs> I, I mean, I mean, it gives me something to do. I mean, I, I, I wanna, I wanna bend the city to its knees. Have you, have you ever tried like running for office? What? No, no, I, no, I, I mean, where, where's the fun of that? There, there's, there's no like a monster destroying anything, or you know, and plus, I mean. Look at me. I, I mean, yeah, you know, there, there's like, there's more than just humans on Earth, too. But I mean, like, you know, I'm, I'm a skeleton. Like, there, there's no other skeletons walking around. Well, maybe you should change that and make this place a more welcoming environment for skeletons. R roll charisma. <laughs> <laughs> if this fails, I'm just going to use the shotgun. Oh. <laughs> what? Oh. Wait a minute. What was his? Was his inspiration? Yeah, his um or his charisma was the. Yeah, the shit one. Oh no, no, his wisdom was the shit one. Oh, his charisma is just not a modifier there. Yeah. <clears throat> hmm. <laughs> I uh. Huh. You know, maybe you're right. Maybe. I should try to change that and have, yeah, yeah. They they need to respect us skeletons. They they can't just keep treating us like criminals. I, I mean, yeah, I've tried to destroy this city countless times, so I, I guess you know I, I guess I can understand it for me. But they they should try to accept us. You know what? I thank you, thank you for that advice. You know what? I'm I'll work on that right now. He that starts Ox making man? the he starts making the lightning bolts again. So when's the monster coming? Oh well, um, I mean, it, well, uh, well, I, I mean, I was going to to kind of change that, but uh, well, you see, now since you gave me the idea of you know may, uh, having skeletons be accepted, I'm going to make an army of skeletons to help the monster. Whoa! Can he use the shotgun? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. He... He... F <laughs> just... Whoa! Pulls out fires. <laughs> and... Now... He gets um, through as, his as it, as it <laughs> hit, like, the, the shell did go through his robe. But there was just like a hole that went through because, well, he's a skeleton, and he, he just looks at the hole in, in his robe. What the hell, man? I told you, we you don't hit, you don't attack me. You attack the monster. I mean, you almost seem less reasonable than the monster. But you haven't even seen the monster yet. Well, you won't tell me what the monster looks like. Cause 
I don't know. I but like, you've used it multiple times. It's a different monster every time. Wow. Not even consistent. <laughs> well, I, you gotta keep things fresh, man. Gotta keep it entertaining, you know? You're talking about keeping things fresh while describing yourself in a cycle. Where yes. you do the exact same thing repeatedly. Yeah. You know what? Just screw it. I'm summoning the monster. And um, I, uh, one large lightning bolt strikes the sky as... A purple portal soon opens up amidst the clouds. The clouds start circling around it as a reptilian creature, a, one of humongous proportion, bigger than the skyscrapers of the city, crashes into the ocean and does a uh, very copyright-sounding growl. So I'm not going to describe what that growl sounds like. <laughs> Audio jungle. <laughs> <laughs> the beast audio jungle <laughs> as it's as it storms toward the city <laughs> um did Platt just summon the damn monster like I mean hey guys. Hey! Did you just summon the damn monster? No. I was trying to talk to this skeleton over here, but he's not being very reasonable. It's not doing shot, so I he, heard you shoot. He, he, lo he looks up to the human. L listen, man, I'm, I'm sorry. He, he loves murdering things. I, I'm like... <clears throat> 99% sure he convinced this guy to summon the monster so yeah I'm, I'm i'm sorry about that oh oh yeah no no don't don't worry skull king summons monsters literally every day like we have monster insurance here it's fine oh well can i defeat this monster for them can the stick be the hero of the day uh i i mean i you you can try but we we kind of have to use our ships and more often than not we have to transform them into their m's forms so yeah it, um yeah i i don't think that'll work but I mean, if you want to give it a shot I am oh what's that I am one oh so, sorry sorry my my commander just got back uh civilians aren't allowed to fight sorry Damn! Excuse me. <laughs> so, well, so, if you I, think I, about it, if you think about it, I'm, or I'm an alien civilian. Roll for charisma. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, how how is Wicker's charisma? Oh, his charisma is okay. Fucking four out of a twenty. The human thinks for a moment. You know what? That sounds like sound logic to me. Do, do you you guys want to like like hop in here and we we can or I, I don't know like hop on hop on top of the ship and uh, I I can fly you up there. Uh, I, I I I mean sure I I guess as uh they get. <laughs> on the wings of the ship. Oh, uh, name's Kaido, by the way. I'm uh, Wicker. Hey, uh, name's Cybrix, and uh, this is Sarah. Where are... What the hell's going on? And then <laughs> Cybrix turns her off. Hey, what the hell is going on? Okay, yeah, my I... name's... My, name, my name's Wicker. Nice to meet you. All right, let's do this. The uh, hatch closes and the ship starts rocking, rocketing off towards um, Platt, the Skull King, and the monster. And uh, Boom Boom Clip is like hanging onto one of the wings 
as uh, the ship's flying up. So, Platt can see them approaching, and the Skull King's laughing maniacally again. Yes! Now attack the city! Um, hmm. I, got, I gotta think of a name here. Uh, hmm. George. Mm. I'm thinking. Uh, I'm thinking something that rhymes with Nilla. Mm, nah, it's, uh, it sounds copyrighted. Um, oh no, <laughs> Plant. Do Do you have a good name for for this big old lizard thing? Oh, he he's breathing fire, and it shows that yes, the uh, the monster is breathing fire. Wagon. Wait, hang on. Hey, 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 you, you guys, you guys, you guys with, with the GUM dude. Uh, did, did you say lagging? Lagger. I like lagging. Lagging's a good one. Plant, what do you think? What do you think about lagging? What happened? I, my internet went out. Well, what do you, what do you think about the name lagging? Like lizard dragon. I like that name. Where am I? Well, screw you. We're naming it Lagan anyway. Go attack <laughs> Lagan. Oh, that's right. Okay. Can he? Can Platt try to shoot him again? Yes. <laughs> Damn. He f he flies away and he starts laughing maniacally as he starts disappearing to somewhere. <laughs> Can, and can Platt try to follow him? Yes, you'll have to roll again. Oh god. Fuck. Nope. He gets away before I Platt can follow. Waited. But Platt does turn and see Cybrix, uh, Wicker, and Boom Clip on some sort of uh or on that planetoid spacecraft piloted by um Kaido. I don't know if you Heard that part, but uh, yeah, the human's name's Kaido. <sighs> you know what? Can I thing? use my inspiration? Sure. To to try to follow? Yeah. Yes. All right. The uh, the hey. skeleton dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just just before the skeleton dude's swirly cloak portal closes. Uh, Platt flies in, and he's gone. Great. Thanks, man. Letting us deal with the lagging. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Wicker. Um, yes, Wicker. So here to uh, save the day. <clears throat> yeah. So, uh, how um, how are we gonna beat all that? He's like motioning his hands to show just how big the lagon is as it's well, slowly approaching the city. Well, just so you know, I am able to shoot fire and I can do <laughs> I can do telekinesis. Oh, so. And you cut out when saying both the things you can shoot. So it was just I can shoot. And <laughs> <laughs> it did the same for me too. All right, I'm gonna start dummying my sentences. Shoot, fire, thorns, control, pull, mind. <laughs> oh, okay. Um. Well, well, I guess just hit it with everything you got, and um, Kaido starts firing the crafts, um, oh, laser oh. cannons. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wicker's like what? Ten feet tall now? Cause Yes. Well, he's, like, he's, he, he's six feet tall. What if he Matt, like, can conjure up a form and come? Oh <laughs> you, <God. keep, laughs> you keep. Discord <laughs> keeps cutting you out at the most important parts of what you said. Hold on. Hold on. Let, yeah, me, like, let, me, let me hang up and come back. I have never, like. Uh, that's happened before, but never this consistently. <laughs> yeah, no, like, it's it literally seems like Discord does not want you to say your ideas. It's just like, Jacob, no, shut up. <laughs> shut up, Jacob. Now we're going to be on the arc where Platt just joins the skeleton. Oh, man. 
I mean, I was kind of hoping we'd be on Earth 2 for a little bit, but... I, I didn't <laughs> I didn't roll that, by the way. But what I was going to say... Can you hear me now? Yes. I was going to say, I can conjure up a thorn storm and then set those thorns on fire so that way it's an endless flame and it can hit the monster. All right. Yeah, I didn't I mean, mean to roll give, that result, give, by the way. Give just, it a shot. Do I have to re-roll, or are you going to use that 10? You'll, nah, you can re-roll. You have to roll 2d20 this time. Okay. Hold on. Skiddy bop um data. Skibbity bop what um data? Skiddy bop um data. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Okay, I gotta delete the one and replace it with a <clears throat> 2. Well, that's a 3. That's a 2. There we go. Okay. Okay. So, Winker does start firing out a barrage of splinters along with the ship's laser fire and then combines those with his flame uh, gun in order to light his uh, splinters to make a barrage of flame that's hitting the lagon. Um, it does roar. Now, I'm going to do an intelligence check for Cybrix here. Nice man being a bitch today. Probably ain't gonna get a good number. I did. Good. Cybrix <laughs> uh, turns to Wicker. Hey, um, you probably don't want to be doing that. Why? Considering, well, considering that this thing breathes fire and, um, well, that doesn't seem to be doing much damage. Seems to have just roared because it felt something tickling it. Okay. <laughs> I just thought of another awesome idea. <laughs> I, I thought of an awesome idea. What? Hunter, Hunter, are you still there? Damn, he's not. I had I had a good idea for him. Well, we Cybrix can do it too. No way. I got it. I was gonna say that <clears throat> Wicker should like find a massive boulder and then like use his telekinesis to like swing that boulder and hit. I him. I have an idea. What? <clears throat> okay. As Kaido's firing, <clears throat> the laser shots aren't having any effect. I guess it's time. EMS mode! As he pushes a button, the ship begins to turn. The uh, wings start um, twisting out, and robot arms and legs sprout from the ship, as well as a head. It is now a mech. Now here is my idea. Like I said, Wicker can be used as a bow staff. Yes, he can. If, if he can try to extend himself even more <coughs> using... Um, oh my god. Uh, what's that guy's name again? I forgot his name. Kaido. Kaido? Kaido. Oh, Kaido. Kaido, do you... By any chance, you got any, like, miracle grow or plant feed? Uh, I, I think there's a miracle grow button in here somewhere. Uh, yeah! And he pushes... Uh, a miracle grow button. <laughs> We had to use it to take care of a plant monster a few weeks back. You made that plant monster grow? But that, yeah. that's, beside, that's besides the point. Uh, can you we, dump some on me? Yeah, we made it too top-heavy to be able to do anything. Here! And, um, like, one of the mech's fingers raises up above um, <laughs> Wicker's head, and then, like, it opens up and just, like, a small bit of miracle grow starts going down. Um, can you have Wicker roll again? Oh! Wicker grows not just 10 feet tall. He is now 20 feet tall. Yo, what's up, guys? Oh. I'm so tall. <laughs> with, with that, uh, <laughs> Cybrix. Oh, I think I got it. Kaido. I'm, now, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a bow staff now. <laughs> you, think, 
<laughs> you can use him to uh, stab that monster. I'll certainly give it a shot. He grabs Wicker and holds him like, like a sword. Oh, use my foot. It's pointy. Charging in. Oh, boy. Okay, you know what? I'm just... I'll, I'll roll for... Actually, um, I'll have Kaido roll. And could I have you roll again, Jacob? To see how effective their attacks are. Damn. <laughs> Would Should you I like use to use your inspiration? Yeah, That's use your... Yes, use your inspiration. Dice Maiden, I, I love you. Well, she does not love you. <laughs> Fucking rejected. <laughs> as, as, as he slams Wicker onto the wagon. That's I, like he just breaks. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not that bad. Um, well, it might be worse. Uh, as Wicker hits onto... Lagan's like shoulder. Lagan slowly turns his head with a very annoyed look and stares Wicker right in the face. What are you looking at? You're mighty ugly. <laughs> he breathes his fire right onto Wicker. Wicker is caught on fire. Oh, this, this is bad. Well, wait, aren't they over the ocean? Yes, they are over the ocean. Okay, can um, he just like can he just like get away and like fall in the water? He's he's got a yeah. Oh, I mean, doesn't he, he have fire in him? No. Then how does he have a flame thrower, a, a a flame blaster if he's a stick who can? Sh he's got he's got he's just got one. He's just got one with him. It, it's it's in his ass. I don't know. <laughs> it's a magical ass. <laughs> yeah, that's what that crystal's for. Ooh, that crystal might be able to get upgraded. Uh, maybe. <laughs> now, we cut back to Platt. Um, now, uh, Skull King is in his lair now, and he's just sitting on his throne, and he's got, like, a, a magic screen watching the fight go on. And he, he's sitting there with his, like, a bucket of popcorn. He's eating it. Yeah, kick his ass, ass. lagging. <laughs> wow, they're struggling. What the? How did? How'd you get in here? Through the big portal that you created to get in here. Uh, uh, I didn't. I didn't know people could also go through that. Oh, damn it. Uh, well, uh, are, are you gonna try to kill me? I don't know. Oh, did? Do you wanna like? Watch the fight. I guess. Sure. Popcorn. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um. Oh. Yeah. You're. You're a plant. Uh, can. Can you eat this? Kinda. Oh. He He drops <laughs> one piece of popcorn into into his dirt into his soil. <laughs> wow. So that's what popcorn tastes like. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, you know, that that's the extra butter kind. <laughs> wow. I don't I don't really like extra butter myself, but I it, it's the only thing I had. Uh when I when I went to the store, they didn't have just the regular butter, just the, they only had extra, so What kind of store do you go to? I mean, I mean they they have just a food tigers over there at the edge of town. I mean, yes, I I am a criminal, but I mean, you know, they they still serve serve you. I mean, you know. Well, what are they what are they gonna do? Not let me buy food? <laughs> Man, this world is weird. I t tell me about it. I'm talking to a potted plant. Hey guys, I'm gonna go <laughs> downstairs and uh, munch on something, and I'll Gee. be back. Okay. Anyways, <laughs> in a top hat at that, yeah. with a shotgun. Yeah, with a shotgun with him at all times. <laughs> I can't wait until he gets a double barrel.
<laughs> I, just, I imagine like like he'll he'll get like an upgrade that makes it some sort of like laser cannon just like gun but it's still a shotgun <laughs> like it doesn't change <laughs> Sorry, y'all. I gotta pee real quick. Yeah, that's fine. Was you asking me something? Um, did uh, did Plant want to say anything else? Gavin, hello, hello. Can can anyone hear me? Guys? Uh... Guys? Hello? Kevin's internet go out? Hello? Guys? Guys, can die. There. Okay, you're here. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Gavin died. Okay. Damn. Yeah. I just rejoined the call because it completely kicked me out. And and Gavin died. So, uh, I mean, did are are you are you ready to? Yeah. To play, what was she saying? Yeah, I'm good. What was she saying to my character? Oh, I wasn't saying anything to your character. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I went ahead and eat while I was trying to get Discord to come back up. Oh, Gavin, you hit you back? Yes. Yes. Okay. We both died. I don't know why. Hi, baby. We're going kitty kitty. So what I miss? Um, I was asking you if Platt said anything more because we didn't cut back to the fight yet. Oh. Well, I guess we'll see how the monster gets beat this time. Yeah, every time with those M's and and that that, that stick. I mean, yeah, I, I don't think he, he'll be able to do anything, but I, I don't know. I wouldn't underestimate Wicker. Wicker. Hmm. I should name him Monster after that. Nope. Maybe, maybe I should make just like a... Like a big old wooden, wooden doll monster. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'll make that tomorrow. You know... So... You like destroying things with monsters, right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean, it's, it's, it's great. Fun. Hmm. After this fight concludes, I have a proposition. Mm. Okay. And we cut back to the fight <laughs> as Wicker is on fire. Oh boy. Someone help me! I'm... Uh, uh, can't, can't, can't you dip him in the water? Uh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm trying! As oh, This crystal God. will only protect me for so long! It's a magical crystal. My, my my ass crystal will only protect me for so long. <laughs> my ass my asshole can only protect me for five whole minutes. <laughs> As Kaido was trying to dip, um, was trying to uh, dip Wicker into the water. Lagan grabs Wicker and just shakes his head. <laughs> Wait, oh. Did the wind just blow it out if that if he shook him that hard? Uh, I mean, possibly. That's SpongeBob. <laughs> he just jumps out of the water. He just squirts water in his head. I'm gonna have Cybrix. Damn. Oh my god. You know what? No, no, I'm using inspiration. Please. Yeah, because you have the ink or something, don't you? Correct. Holy what shit. What the fuck? 
Can we have like an extra inspiration for this session? No, this is... no. Cause that, no, cause that, that makes it, cause that'll just make it, you know, cause we're, we're not supposed to always win. That's the point. And to be fair, there's no guarantee that the extra inspiration will be worth anything. That's true. Yeah. All right. Just, 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 I'm not going to use it, but just to see what the next number would have been if we used an extra inspiration. It should be a higher number. Oh, go fuck yourself by Dice I, Wow. That's why I said it should have been a higher number, because I was sitting here going back and looking at the algorithm numbers. Consume dick, please. <laughs> uh, she, she probably will. So, Cybrix tries to... He tries to open up uh, his attachment and fire ink at Wicker to stop the fire from spreading. However, it's not coming out. Uh, oh, no. No. Oh, d don't tell me it's jammed. No, I can't use my lasers anymore. Damn it. Okay, so what what do you want to try to do to get out of that, Jacob? Um, well, is he still in the hands of that monster? He's in one hand of that monster. He he's in Kaido's um like mech hands and um Lagan's hand, the monster's okay, hand. Okay, who has the ass part of it? <laughs> oh my god. Because I'm, I'm wondering if I can, Kaido like, has that fire. Part. Oh, Kaido does? Yes. Oh, because I was thinking maybe I could shoot fire and then, like, burn the monster the, of the game. The fire, but the fire wasn't affecting him, remember? That's what um, Cybrix oh. did the check for that. Wait, so this is a BS oh, campaign, yeah. right? Yes. What if, at, like, this precise second, Wicker shrunk down... So that then we just fall into the water. <laughs> sure, yeah. Roll, roll for that. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Dice maiden back to her old sixteens again. How many of these do we get? I feel like this is the most common it, thing to it's, roll. It's her favorite number, apparently. <laughs> So wait, wait, wait! Hold up, hold up, hold up! Before we even continue, let me look at something. Uh, have you guys noticed what date it was? What do you mean, what date? It's. I'm pretty sure it's May sixteenth. No, it's the fourteenth. No, it's the fourteenth. Oh, okay. I was gonna say maybe it's her birthday, and she just wants us to notice. No. <laughs> Not nah, sixteen is just her favorite number, I guess. So. Uh, Wicker, while he is in pain, he tries to use his powers, and he starts shrinking down more and more until he is out of Lagan's hand, but also out of Kaido's hand, and he falls down toward the ocean below. There's a little plip as he falls in. So the fire is gone, and he's not burned anymore. <sighs> hey, uh, Wicker, you you okay, man? No gas. Yeah, he's fine. <laughs> okay, well, uh, now and <laughs> Cybrix looks up and sees Lagan staring at him. Oh no, K Kaido, p please let me in your mech. Please, please, he's opening his mouth. Please, no, no, and uh. Uh, we we cut back to the Skull King and um, Platt as they see Cybrix get just absolutely crisp. Oh, that wow. sucks. Yep, it uh, looks like we're having calamari tonight. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> eh. Oh, here he, he's your friend, isn't he? I like him. Ah, oh, yeah. I'm I'm sorry about that. I'm sure he'll be okay. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, they, we escaped a Swarth child. Oh, wait, you, you, man, you're lucky. You're, I you're wish I would have died there. <laughs> oh. Well, I mean, I mean, there, there's definitely more out there, so, you know. Thanks for the reminder. Yeah, you're, you're, you're all, yeah, hey, you, you, you got, like, got, like, a problem or something? Like, I, I'll, I'll hear you out, like, you know, I, I got nothing else to do, really. It was weird. That was the first time I had ever left the planet and, or the home world, or the, the planet that I lived on. And staring into space is one thing. Watching something be consumed by it is another. Anyways, you know, I'll just give you my proposition now. You like destroying things with big monsters. I like seeing things destroyed, especially whenever the things have people in them and those people die. I think that's pretty cool. However, me, that cybernetic cephalopod, that stick, and... I guess that boombox man, wherever he is, are currently on a mission that involves destroying very big things with extreme prejudice. Mm, I'm listening. So, d are you, do you know Captain Crunch? How could you <laughs> not know Captain Crunch? I mean, he's all over the news. Do you want to be all over the news? Well, more? Uh, well, I mean, I, I guess it, it would be nice to be on universal news for a change instead of just this planet's news. Well, I imagine it would be quite the story if monsters started taking out the pi pirate ships and maybe even if a skeleton with a big black coat cloak, sorry, and red shades took down the pirate captain. He's starting to... Can, can you roll for charisma here? Now, I will just say you won't have to roll high. <laughs> he's shaking it. He's, or he's nodding to himself. Yeah. And then, once I take down the pirate captain, I can show the entire universe the true terror of the Skull King! Sure. At least you won't be as bad as him. You know what? I like you, plant, or... Do you, do you have an actual name? Well, whenever I came across these people, they just started calling me Platt for some reason. And I've been going I, with that. Sounds like Platinum. I like it. Yeah. All right, Plat. Got <clears throat> yourself a deal. I'll, Could uh, you not murder them, though? We're oh, friends. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Here, um, let me... <laughs> we, we come back to <laughs> As, uh... Um... <laughs> As Kaido is having the mech like block the flames from lagging, as as Cybrix is just charred on the shoulder of the mech. Hey, man, you doing all right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm doing fine. Yeah, fine. <laughs> <laughs> and suddenly. The sky opens up once more with that purple portal. Kaido is looking up, very confused. Uh, that's not normal. What's not normal? Uh, he never summons two monsters at once. This could be bad. Um, uh, Commander, you might have to get Nosmus over here. But, 
from that portal comes a purple lightning bolt, a large one. And it not only strikes Lagon, it vaporizes Lagon. And and it it wasn't even just like a, a you know, Lagon was programmed to um, just disappear when this hit. No, Lagon wasn't expecting it. Lagon's eyes go wide and you hear a scream of pain as Lagon is completely vaporized in that blast, which Platt is even surprised by this. Uh, Whoa! He, he did not expect the Skull King to have that level of power. Can Wicker come out of the water and be like, can Wicker come out of the water and be like, I did! Yes! <laughs> Wicker, what did you do? <laughs> I did it! What are you doing, baby? And then Skull Kit. Oh, oh, you, you like that? Yeah, yeah, I can, yeah, I, I can do that to kill all the monsters. I, I guess I, I guess I could use that to like, I don't know, destroy most of the city. But ah, that, that's just kind of too easy, you know. Yeah, it's always nice having a challenge. That's why I use a shotgun instead of anything else. Ah, a plan after my own heart. Or, well, I, I don't, I don't have a heart. I mean, literally. And he like moves his cloak back just to, sh to show that yes, he only has a rib cage, which is currently filled to the brim with popcorn. Well, at least I didn't try to kill you more. That would have taken a while. I just, I Corey, I just yeah. imagine. I just imagine this skeleton full of popcorn just taking steps and that's he he's just dropping <laughs> popcorn. Uh, no, I'm imagining he reaches into his rib cage, takes out a piece of popcorn, puts it in his <laughs> mouth. <laughs> Re eats yeah. it. Yeah. Hey, you want some? I'm good. Uh, well, more, <laughs> more for me then. <laughs> he pops another one in his mouth. So good. <laughs> I think I'm going to try it a second time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I am so good. I think I'll have it a second time. <laughs> he just bites off his finger. Well, no, because he spit the burger out and put yeah. it back in his mouth. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know that. I remember the episode from SpongeBob, but I'm saying the skeleton just bites his finger. <laughs> So, the okay. Um, we cut back to our group as the Skull King reappears with Platt, who's still flying. <laughs> and, uh, hey guys, Wicker has floated back up onto the mech. Uh, I, I think I'm starting to be able to breathe again. <laughs> Platt, what the hell did you do? Did you do that? No, it was this guy. Oh, hey. The, the Skull King. You're, you're under a, arrest. Uh, C Commander, um, the Skull King's here. Yeah, no, no, he, he's not maniacally laughing. No, I, I don't think he's summoning a monster. Are, are you summoning another monster? No, 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 not, not today. Oh, yeah, no, not, not today. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, so are you like going to attack me directly now? Oh no 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 no! I'm um, I guess I'm going on a little uh, vacation. Yeah, vacation with uh my new friend here. Friends! Wait, hold up. You and Platt are friends? Uh, yeah. I mean, I mean, we watched the fight together, ate popcorn together. I mean, you know, what What else are friends for? Didn't the popcorn get through you considering you're a skeleton? No. Takes out another piece of popcorn from his ribcage and eats it. <laughs> That's like the run-on joke at this campaign. I know. Oh. I, love this. I love Skull King. Friendship <laughs> is almost as fun as murder. 
<laughs> Simon Pierce is looking very confused. So Wait, who's going? Is he going with us now? Or Yeah, we're gonna go kill space pirates together. All of us. It's gonna be oh. great. Oh okay. Oh whoa, 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 whoa. You guys are going after the KKK? Uh Yeah. Yeah. Com commander? Yeah, they're yeah. Oh you heard. Is that Nosmus? Yeah, no, Nosmus. Yes, I, I know. Yeah, look, I, I didn't kill. Yes, I didn't kill. Look, stop calling me a scrub, please. Okay, yeah, yeah, I know. Mhm. Mm yeah. So you guys are going after the KKK. So we've actually been trying to devise a plan to uh, to take them out. Um. I, I don't know if if you guys want want our help with that, um, but we could we could try to do something. I think the commander, yeah, com commander, is is it okay if they they come over to help? Yeah, yeah, with the plan. Yeah. Oh yeah. Does it involve yeah. murder? Does it involve murder? Probably. She said probably. Yes. Oh well. Oh, I'm so we're we're actually like gonna oh. be working together. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's kind of weird, actually. Um, but yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, I mean, weren't you both already kind of working together? I mean, uh, not really, kind of, but no, it's, it's kind of a whole thing. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's just kind of like a, a routine. We weren't like working together, but I, I guess we were kind of, you know, working. Well, it together. seems like. It seems like you both sort of give each other a purpose. They look at each other. I guess you could say it like that. Uh, yeah, yeah. They seem very awkward. And then, bam, anyway, uh, yeah, here, um, I can take you uh, to the militia base and uh, we'll talk to the commander and uh, get you guys up to speed. If Wicker yeah. actually asks Skull King a question. Yeah. So, uh, Skull, wait, am I small or am I big right now? You're small. Okay, because that, that depends on his voice. Um, so, do you think maybe uh, you could maybe, you know, shove a piece of that popcorn in my ass? Because I'm kind <laughs> of. <laughs> uh, shh. Sure, go nuts. <laughs> he, he, he holds out. He, he holds out the popcorn, and Wicker uses his telekinesis to move it over. And he shoves it in his ass. I like how we don't even know like what <laughs> his ass looks like. There's just yeah. some like hole somewhere. Bet, that's how. Like I, I just imagine it. As um like like you As know Wicker how having it confused how, how some trees have just those like holes in them yeah like that, that's how like I imagine that. it just a small hole yeah well, could, like do you think maybe Wicker's just having his like mouth and asshole confused well <laughs> how how no because it's been as it's literally just been established that his his mouth. Like technically, it's not an ass. Yeah. Because because like there he doesn't he doesn't poop. He ju he just talks through it. So it is his mouth. The only reason <laughs> that it's called an ass is because it's down where an ass would be. Yeah, this is funny. <laughs> <laughs> Gavin's dying. So I I think that's a perfect. Uh, that's a perfect segue to saying that um, Kaido starts leading everyone toward the GUM base, and that's the end of tonight's session, because, oh boy!